So what's next? Where does the industry go next? Well, we, we personally think it's, it's to the software-defined data center. What the software-defined data center will do, will have pools of storage, pools of compute, pools of network, built-in automation, built-in security, and then you'll be able to run each of those applications. And the way you'll talk to the software-defined data center is you'll say, these are the SLAs that I need met. Have to meet these SLAs, these service levels. These are the policies that we're instituting that also have to be met. And the third, third measure you'll give it is cost metrics. I have to stay within this cost. So meet these SLAs, make sure we adhere to these policies, and make sure we stay within this cost. Then the magic of the software to find data center automation takes over, and it says, how many cores do I need to do that HPC environment? Maybe I need a lot of cores. What kind of storage do I need to, 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 to build dynamically? Maybe flash-based, very fast storage. Usually HPC environments don't have a ton of storage, but they need very fast storage. So it'll basically build that for you, and then and when you're not using it, even for small periods of time, it'll put it back into the pool. So again, and, and again, you can run all your environments and it's very flexibly, and that's the way we believe a true cloud work, and this is the way a software defined data center will play. So that's our vision and what we're driving. Again, in the physical world, if you think about it, it took months and weeks to provision a physical server. In the virtual environment, that was brought down to days and even hours. And in the software defined data center, we're going to be thinking minutes, seconds, and even subseconds, and how fast this provisioning and how dynamic this provisioning will be. So, tremendous benefits. We've taken one step further. We've teamed with our, our partner, Cisco. And of course, Cisco to V Block adds the, the networking and the server, EMC, the virtualization through VMware, and of course, the, uh, the storage. And again, we're giving you, if you will, a data center to block ready. And again, it's the promise of software defined data center is not there today, but it's what we're working on, and it's, and it's moving quickly. And again, software defined data center ready.